Hey guys, we're in a search for a really small pump for my Dahan folding bikes. We got this online. This is basically a Sportineer um, mini bike pump we got for around $12 or $13. I'll leave a link below if you're interested in looking at that product. Um, and also, you know, a few links below for other ones too. This is our third pump. The one we have was, a, the first one we did was a Swin. Then we had this $5 pump. Now we have this aluminum one we got online. The nice thing is that it does come with other fun accessories like um, a patch kit, some hardware, as well as tire levers that connect together, which I thought was a nice touch in terms of value add for the package. But overall, this whole pump is actually made of all aluminum, and which is nice. It's really sturdy looking and feel, and it also has a nice frame mount that you can strap it on next to your bottle, uh, bottle cage, which is cool too. Overall, quality build is really nice. Um, the accessories were nice as well. The, and the fact that the levers clamped together was nice. This is what we're putting it onto on our folding bike. This is one of them. So it, as you see, there's a lot of stuff on it. So this thing fully extended has a little tube that sticks out to the thing, which is nice. So you could just screw it onto your the nipple and pump. The handle and the and the main body is made of aluminum that has, that has um, fine lines on it for grip. Um, it it's cool that it's all aluminum. It looks really sturdy. It even has a little dust cap for when this tube retracts into the pump, which makes it extremely small and compact in design. But the nozzle is hard to put on. It's a screw-on type. It's not too hard, but it's, it does kind of have a hard feel for it. But that's the point, not the point. The drawback of this thing was actually the pumping action. It's really difficult to pump that tiny little thing. Even though my tires are really tiny, these are Swallaby um, like 60 pounders, 60 pound tires. And it was extremely hard to just pump a few pumps into this. It's either because of the connector or maybe it's just the, this pump was maybe it was defective. I don't know. But it was extremely hard to put even some pressure into it. Eventually we did pump it, but overall it's a lot of effort and my hand was starting to get you know blisters doing this thing. So yeah, I, I prefer the Schwinn uh, multi-pump that was a floor pump, a mi micro floor pump, which was a lot easier. Overall, the cold um, aluminum um, design is good in terms of durability but at the same time it hurts my hand using it you probably need some gloves if you're gonna do this a lot but anyways that's my quickie review and unboxing of this uh the mini pump please like subscribe hit the bell button for more finds and other bike stuff and see you next time bye